Well, let's start off with the Cricket World Cup, talking about the 2020 Under-19 Cricket World Cup. Australia bounced back from their defeat to the West Indies by claiming a 10-wicket win over the Bhutan Nigeria at the championship holding in South Africa. Let me throw this to Prof first. When I was expecting Nigeria to upset Australia, uh, knowing that um, it, it can happen, anything can happen when it comes to the world of sports, but it didn't get to happen. And um, there's a particular group I belong to, a sports group, and when I put it up there, someone made a comment. He said, over age can work in football but it can't work in other sports, especially <laughs> cricket. Uh, Uduka, absolutely. Um, anything can happen. Yes, it's a cliche, but I tell you, certain things will not happen. And one of them is a Nigerian team defeating any kind of team in cricket from Australia. You're talking about the culture, the tradition of a people. Cricket over there is a way of life. Mm. Here, we are just starting. Is on the 19th. Let the boys go over there, learn, see how it is being done professionally, come back home, then begin to start. We have not started yet. Okay. Uh, look, I remember we qualified for this tournament about uh, seven months ago. Exactly. And, uh, we've had a lot of preparation. And I remember uh, the president of the Korean Federation saying something that the boys have made him proud mm. qualifying at all for this because it is the first time ever Nigeria will be attending. You know the cricket, cricket championship at that level, mm. at, any, at level. any level, any level, at any level, and uh, like a prof said, is I will be surprised if even our main cricket team defeats another 15 cricket team from Australia. Wow. Wow. So no, no, see, um, nobody should you know uh, bring out the sticks for you know, this boys. The boys you know, yeah. for, uh, uh, we are in a group that has Australia, mm. West Indies, England, two of the England. Two of the best in the world, and you know, top four, top five in the world. So mm. <laughs> let us just go there. So we are going to learn, and my concern will be after this competition mm. if we do not have positives to take home. To take home. Qualifying is a victory for us. Yes. Mm. Victory. Victory, you know, we've done what we've never been able to do before. Mm -hmm. We defeated the likes of Kenya, Namibia, yeah. you know, I mean. <laughs> so we shouldn't um, bring out the sticks, like you said, um, for the boys. And 10 wickets. We yeah, 10 manage. wickets. <laughs> we can manage it. We spoke with Shinwa Jidagba on the performance of the lads. Let's listen to him. And when we return, the show would continue. History was eventually made today at the Cricket World Cup, where the Junior Yellow Greens, which is the junior national team of uh, Under-19, uh, played against uh, Australia, who are champions in 1988, 2002, and 2010. And they were also runners up. Last time at the World Cup, they lost to India. So they have more experience than the cricket national team of Nigeria. We batted first uh, and uh, decided to play a paltry 61 runs all out in 30.3 overs. Star performer for Nigeria in the first innings was Ola Leye, who had 21 runs off 53 balls. But he also set the record as the first Nigerian to score the first four or score the first boundary at a cricket uh, World Cup at under-19 level. At the end of the day, it was 61 runs all out for us. Paltry runs, you want to say, are uh, not good enough uh, to defend. We lost by 10 wickets. Up next for us is against West Indies, who are also champions of the Cricket World Cup in 2016. And our last game will be on the 25th, uh, which is against our Colonial Masters England, who have also won the World Cup before in 1998 like i said before we are making our debut at the world cup in terms of experience we don't have as compared to all the teams that um, we are facing so the history we have made is to qualify for the cricket world cup and i hope that the boys can just bask in that euphoria yes lessons must have been learned from today's loss and i hope they put up a spectacular performance against west indies i know it will be very very difficult no doubt uh, but like i've always said Cricket and biscuits, even while having fun, you can go out there and spring some surprises. Don't just lose scandalously. Uh, lose with your head held high. But in all honesty, there is no way the boys from Nigeria will get out of this group. We are very excited that they've qualified for the Cricket World Cup for the very first time. And so, let's uh, enjoy and savor this moment. All in all, I wish the team all the best. Wishing them all the best. Talking about Tashima Jideba, wishing the under 19 cricket team from Nigeria all the best in the ICC under 19 cricket World Cup.